Hi everyone, Steve Stokes with Remax Sunshine. You know, I show houses almost every day here in Southwest Florida. Last couple of days I've been showing to a great couple with a budget of around a million dollars. And after a lot of homes, this was the winner. This is why I want to show it to you guys. This home really has just about everything that we were looking for. And I'm really curious to put it out there, see what you think of it. So first of all, it's a 2023 build. So it's basically, it's a new construction. It's a three bedroom, three bathroom Plus it has a den, 2,147 square feet. That means it's gonna be under $500 a square foot. Opens up into this great room, this beautiful um, 24 by 48 porcelain tile floor. You've got that accent wall with the electric fireplace. You've got the nine foot slider doors with the 90 degree breakaway, which is awesome. Nice dining area here. You've got the funky modern light package throughout the entire home. That fireplace doesn't flash like that. I, I'm shooting this at 60 frames a second in 4K, which I shoot all my videos in, so it captures the, the light, but it doesn't, it doesn't flicker when you look at it normally. How about this great kitchen? Quartz countertop, got the waterfall, which I really like. Got the wall uh, combo unit there with the stove and the oven. Black stainless steel. And uh, as a bonus, you've got this section here on the, on the back wine cooler and another workstation. Really like that. And I like that black stainless steel. I'm seeing more and more of that. Let's go into the first bedroom here. Pretty standard uh, bedroom. Again, the floor bleeds into all the rooms. But how about this pool bath? Really nice. It has the floating vanity. And I like this, this wood-like finish of this tile. It's textured. Got to feel that. Wow, look at that, feels great, looks cool, beautiful floor. So this wood look tile, it really, and it matches of course the vanity, it really warms up this, this bathroom. You've got this great door that goes out there to the pool, we'll see that in a bit. This house has seven foot interior doors throughout. Here is the other bathroom, we get the light here. And I love the way that they did this. Again, another floating vanity, but make this one white and a textured tile there as well, but a different one, which I really like. Here's your second bedroom. Very nice. And if I spin around here, you can see that the, the closets in this home all have the build-ins, which is a nice touch by the builder. Again, back through the kitchen, look at that thick quartz countertop. Just a little extra look here at the wall unit, which I really like when they include those. Here's your laundry room area with a full-size washer dryer, nice uh, pantry or a linen storage area. Epoxy floor out here in the garage, three car garage. And not to be left out, we do have an exterior door here that runs around the side of the building. Always good to see that. Of course, this home is all to code hurricane impact resistant glass and doors. And I want to mention also the roof, which we'll look at in a minute. It's got a clay tile roof, which is super great. Here's what I like about this house most of all. In addition to the three bedrooms, we have a den, separate, right? Great, everybody wants this. Great little exercise room, but in this case, it's gonna be a great office. Double doors. Beautiful in the front with the eastern exposure. You're going to get the sunrise every morning in that office. And it separates from the bedrooms, which is awesome. There's a nice look at the electric fireplace. You go, of course, you can change the colors. I have the Krypton, kryptonite green on there. It's what I came up with, but opinions vary on that. Here is the main bathroom. Check out this huge closet with the custom, custom shelving. And on the other side, let me get the light the same. So those are great. Bifold doors going to those, but those are great. Here is your main bathroom. You've got a nice tub. Again, the quartz. And we have the split sinks on each side. There's your loo. Lots of space in here. I hope it conveys. This is big, wide open. Nice area here. And check it out. The glass doors on the car wash shower. Nice touch. Someone mentioned in the comments before they need those so their dogs don't go in the shower. I never thought of that before. Hey, also somebody was complaining that there wasn't double heads. We've got the double shower heads in this one. They'll be happy with that. 
Here's a good look at the counter. Another quick back view of that. Really like it. Nice and bright. Hello, everybody. Thanks for watching. I do appreciate it so much. And we're going to come back out here through this beautiful porcelain tile flooring. I'm going to open the 90 degree breakaway. And there's a few surprises out here as well, which I can't wait to show you. So obviously we've got a nice paver job out here, but bingo, we've got a real nice outdoor kitchen here with the exterior range hood that you absolutely need to have, right? Here's your view. We're in the Southwest. This is all city water, city sewer. And this is an oversized pool. Okay. So this is a, how big is this pool? Let me think. What were they saying? Oh, it's a 32 by 15 pool. So 32 feet by 15 feet. And I know this jacuzzi here is six by six. There's a lot of weeds out here though. The builder hasn't been taking care of those weeds. I gotta get rid of those. Other than that, it's immaculate. Look at that beautiful pool. Low profile, low entry hot tub. Clear view panels here on the screen. Look at that. It gives you the impression of almost having an infinity pool when you don't have one, which is awesome. There's that super sleek door that runs to the pool bath. And then a quick look on the side of your house of your pool equipment. This is a salt water pool. It is heated. Believe it or not, some builders, even in this price point, don't include a heater with the pool. You've got a lot of weeds here, but we'll get rid of all those. And hopefully you can see the clay roof on the top. That's a great roof to have here in Florida. They say it's the second best. They say the metal roof is better, but I don't like the look as much. So again, let me know what you think of this beautiful home. I've looked at a lot of houses and I think in that million dollar range, this is your best one today. And this is May, of course, May 3rd, 2024. Please subscribe, thumbs up. Thanks for watching. <laughs> I'll see you guys again soon.